think of a lie If I can make it If I try to draw the red light I could run through the fire I could conquer the night If I can make it If I try to draw the red light Alright, top notch. Oh, dang it. We st oh and we're and we're unicorning it. <laughs> What's up everyone? I don't even have a hat on. Oh I'm so I'm off. I'm off today. I'm off today. <clears throat> there. Ah, now we're now we're prepped. We're prepped for some fishing today, boys and girls. Everyone else in between. How's it going though? I'm excited. <clears throat> feeling, you know, feeling a little bit better. You know, you might have heard little, little sicky here and there, but, but I'm, oh, I'm banging on all cylinders now. Ryan Cody's here. Isaac Peyton Bloom. I'm assuming. Ruben Perez. Gale. Everything easy. Bobby Worst. I don't know. Parker Gale again. Uh, Santiago. Inter T Rex Gaming. Timothy Descato. Anglin. England and wrangling <laughs> that's fun to say John uh, sus gamer three uh, la, 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 moose good doodle good bud <laughs> it's fun to say too. Pollock when's the next river monsters video whenever we can do the next episode what's the next episode why haven't we done it yet huh huh I feel like if you just kind of think about it a little bit you'll work out your own questions sometimes Captain, you're so close. I'm gonna, I'm gonna let you level up one more time before I uh, decline it. Come on, man. Follow the rules. I know a lot of people don't know the rule. It's new. The new rule. Level 50. You gotta be level 50 to be a, to be a friend. And there's not too many spots left. Honestly, we're at 182. That means we have 19 more friends. And then, uh, and I guess that's the end of the BZ Hub's friend group. No more friends after that. We'll have to raise it to 60 then. No, I'm kidding. I don't know what we're gonna do. How are ya? I'm doing quite well. Nate, how are you? The legend! Oh, I don't know about that. CJ, good to see ya. Knives not gaming. 
Have you been playing Call of the Wild recently? No, I haven't. I've been playing Fallout 76 recently, to be quite honest. That's a that's a fun game. I it, I played it when it first came out. It was kind of meh, you know, a lot of issues with it. But honestly, currently, it's I'm, it's fun. It's it's got everything everything that you'd expect from a Fallout game, and, and other people. So, giant bosses, and then you and friends can go, like, uh, take them down and stuff like that. Dude's a blast. Anywho, we're going after Arapaima today. What is this spot right here? What is that spot? Surely we can't just go straight there. Let's see, I'm looking, I'm looking right now. That's the day, that's the day I want, but I'm sure we can catch some in between. Today, we are grinding Arapaima. If you can come fish with us at Amazonian Maze, feel free to join in. Um, but we're gonna we're gonna grind some air, air pima. We're gonna try to work our way up. Everyone keeps bugging me not to call you out. Everything easy. Um, everyone keeps bugging me about when the next uh, River Monsters episode is gonna be. Well, the problem is the next episode takes place in the Congo, and I can't go to the Congo. Because I'm not a high enough level, so I figured during these live streams it might be a good opportunity for us to grind through some fish and um, and and hopefully level up a few times because we're at level 71 right now, I believe. We have some uh, we have some leveling to do, everybody. Luckily, I am an expert boat driver, so it's going to take us no time at all. To uh, make our way to the air pime spot which you all know as well because you watched the river monsters episode it's like that operation game when I drive I never touch the sides yeah I, it's like when you're bowling and you don't have the uh, the little gutter guards on that's what I'm like when I drive I don't need the guards on either because I never touch the sides it's just you know, I make it look easy uh, should do Triura Farm. You know, I tried a little bit, um, a little bit here and a little bit there for Triura. You do catch, you can catch a lot of Triura. Uh, don't get me wrong. Um, but I like, I like the Arapaima. I feel like they're uh, quicker. Catch more of them. Honestly, it comes down to what you could catch at night, but I figured we'd experiment a little bit. Experiment a little bit. Let's we'll start with the Arapaima, and if we can find a good, uh, if we can find a good spot, then, uh, then yeah, we'll just uh, grind away. Grind, 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 grind. Use a flut with three inches. Thank you. I've never caught Arapaima before, so it's good to know that people are letting me know how to do it. Because <clears throat> when I go to play games and have fun first thing I like is for other people to tell me how to play. Thanks a lot. See your way out, JK. Alrighty, we're here. Let's get out of here onto this rock. I love how we have this mix of good, like, uh, detail and then bad detail. We have this extremely blurry rock mixed with all these little leaves and stuff. If your screen's blurry because of the stream, then all you're seeing is blurry anyway, so it doesn't really matter. Okie dokie, uh, we have this morning. I do believe you can catch things on this little morning, even if it doesn't seem like much. Let's see. Let's test that theory. But I do think, I don't know if it's going to be on bottom rods or match rods. We'll find out. There's two bottom rods. Now I'll get out two match rods. Might regret doing all this prep, but you know what? That's what we're gonna do. What do we have this at? 37 to 24. But we can only do 20, 22. It's the shortest. It's only four feet deep here. So I can't do a ton. Can't do a ton. Oh, that's not what I wanted. Good deal. Giga Ch Chad? What? Hope to see some unicorns. Oh, I hope so as well. 
Oh, nice. So all grinding now, no more Halloween event. I know, right? Man, I wish they would go on. What's the, uh, what's the, how, uh, Christmas is the next event, right? Christmas is the next event. Should be good. Should be, should be fun. Looking forward to it. Maybe they'll have a new Christmas event. Anyone ever think of that? Should be good. Better boat driver than you. <laughs> That's not good. <laughs> Do you know any other grinds that work other than the surging grind? Because it's getting boring. I I tell you what, the the greatest grind, uh, it, it, is that honestly, it seems like it anyway. I always tell people that the goal when you're at that level is to just not get bored of fishing planet. It's not to uh, level up to level 50, which you want to do. Don't get me wrong, but the uh, the main goal is not to get bored of fishing planet. So I know you want to race through. And you know get to level 50 as fast as possible but you're gonna burn yourself out and get bored of fishing planet and you're gonna end up quitting at 48 anyway because you're just you're so insanely bored of doing the same thing over and over again so I, I recommend you know if you're tired if you're tired of doing this is gonna be a piranha I just know it and what do we got freaking piranha dude it's a trophy piranha though I guess if we're gonna look at the bright side of things. Okay. Well, that was a bad experiment, wasn't it? Oh, Enil, what you doing there, bud? Okay. Well, let's see if we can catch anything at this time. He used to have. Where the heck is it? He used to have a postcard where I scribbled down all the times to fish. Oh, there it is sitting right in front of me and uh, 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 uh. okay well top notch let's try this if we don't catch anything that's okay what would be fantastic is if we could fish for their pine at night that would be great because then we could just move night to night like the sturgeon grind so i'm not sure I don't know. We're just testing things at the moment. We're testing things. Don't you know? Caught like 10 unique trier with a swim bait. Oh, wow. 10 unique ones? That's awesome. Trying to catch trier. You do catch a lot of other fish. I, uh, I, uh, timer time a time ago I'm not sure if you were alive back then cuz you know you know me I'm old um, you know I, I made a video called Triura, uh the the best fish in the game um, so I, I have caught Trier before I know I give off this aura that I've never caught one before and you feel like you need to uh, let me know all about them um, but I but I have caught them before so uh, so yeah, but thanks for reminding me all that stuff. That's great. Find this lake very badly designed in many ways. It it's a bit of a maze, isn't it? They should have named. Oh, that's that's why they called it the Amazonian maze. My God, uh, uh, learning every day. Am I right? Getting to catch another live stream. Greetings from Germany. Oh well, hello there, Bjorn. How are you? Hope everyone's having a fantastic day. Is everyone having a fantastic day? Reaching level 50, decided to pause to watch the stream. Oh, now keep at it, Evan. Go back to it. Get back to it. You know, and maybe the grind is you go fish for Triera during certain days, and then you come back and you fish for uh, Arapaima. Because honestly, it's just going back and forth between these two spots, isn't it? That's got a little bit of bend in the rod, eh? world do we have on here oh okay I'm gonna say I don't see what it is you're farming Paku oh whenever I read Paku I think of tacos for some reason very similar only off by two letters you gotta go England says of the Discord live stream channel, notify about when a YouTube stream starts. 
Uh, no, um, well, I'm not sure how how uh, good it would be, to be honest. I I like the uh, the announcements on the Discord to mainly be about uh, things that are important to me, like uh, if I have to reschedule something or if I want people to know about a video or something. But if I just start putting in every little thing, like every single live stream, that's when people usually uh, dip out of channels because they're tired of, you know, maybe they don't have time to hit every live stream, but they try to hit a lot of them. What is with this reeling? Oh, shoot. He got off. Yes. That was strange, wasn't it? I was thinking to myself, why is he reeling it in so slowly? And it's because there wasn't even a fish on anymore. Literally got off at the last second. I feel like the reeling is different. Did they do the update already? They did. Wow, okay, so this is the new... This is the new reeling update. It has to be. Because look, he can't even reel forward. Wow, look at this. A little bit of Fishing Planet history we're experiencing right now. Yeah, during the Halloween event, we we weren't dealing with this, but this is brand new. So uh, now, this is the new fighting mechanic in Fishing Planet. Um, where you cannot reel if they're pulling out line. gonna give us a lot more of a fight I feel don't you think seems realistic what do you think I'm curious what well, we have another rod going right now but curious what you're all thinking Greg how's he going what's your biggest fish fighter shark didn't you see it in the video come on now give me a harder question what if they had caimans in the game? Do I have game caimans in the game, Danny? Where you been? Iron infused a couple weeks ago. Now I'm having uh, feeling a ton better. Well, that's good. Surging around, but not catching anything. I'm using exact bait, hooks, line, time, and location. You know why that is? Uh, hamster. You know they just put out this uh, update. Who's who's to say they didn't update something about that? What do we got here? This is a pretty big guy. He looks like. Oh my god, it is a new personal record! Oh, that's hilarious. Wow, he is too big to keep. He's too big to keep. Wow, he's owie. Wow, that is new personal record for moi. That is a monster air pima, everybody. Wow, he's owie. 366 pounds. That'll do it, I suppose. We catch one of those in real life. That wouldn't be too bad, huh? He nail smile. I guess kind of always has a smile on with that giant jack lantern on his noggin. Well, that's twenty six thousand XP. Not too shabby. Forty four thousand dollars that we're gonna miss out on because we can't keep it. It's too big. Um, but yeah, nice. That's uh. That's that's a different day, I believe. We'll mark it just so that we can keep track of the times. Cause that was weather cloudy in the evening, and I do believe this one is cloudy midday. So we'll be able to differentiate the two of them. Remember, or we can just get rid of one of them. I don't care. But yeah, we've caught a unique during uh, this time and during this time now. That's good. Good to know. Let's see if we can catch some more. Oh, there goes a rod. <clears throat> Rido, Rido. What do you got here? A freaking croaker or something? Oh, it's a trophy red eye piranha. Okie dokie. Okie dokie. On bait, but I always can quickly get uniques on double swim bait. Ooh. Well, that's good. I, I did bring some stuff like that, too, so we can try that as well. You got the Rainbow Outlaw in 10 minutes. Nice. 10 minutes, man. 
to help reel in one of your four blinking reels. Yeah, that's what we really need. We need uh, He Neal's brother, Hunter He Neal, to uh, stop his hunting and go do some fishing with him. He, uh, he needs some help, I think. <laughs> so, good old Zach's in the chat. You get to witness, Brotato says. Kilo Knight's here as well. That's awesome. That is a fantastic catch. A fantastic catch. What is, uh, I'm curious now, what's like, uh, what's a leaderboard Arapaima? What's that looking like? Like 385 or, or more? Let's see. Fish Arapaima. Where are you? 394. Wow, they go with the 394, but we just got one. Well, look at all the 366s there are. Lots of 366s. Is that just, is that what we got, or did we get 364? Can't quite remember now. We got 366.707, so we should be... 707... Right in here. We're going to be number 42 on the leaderboard. Take that, fishing planet. All right. What's your favorite fish to catch? I like the tarpon. Uh, I think the tarpon are a fun fish, man. All right, so you're thinking a double swim bait, huh? I don't know if I have a double swim bait, per se. Duo swim bait, is that what you're talking about? Let's try it. Too heavy for the rod. You're too heavy for the rod. <laughs> Your mom's too heavy for the rod. Just kidding. Bo, oh, this upcoming weekend is going to hunt huns, chooker, whale, pheasants, and maybe ducks. Wowie zowie, man. That should be fun, John. Whereabouts do you, uh, do you live, huh? Uh, must be somewhere up, up north, maybe? South Dakota? You in the Dakotas? Two hours to get the bait for it. Ooh. Also, what's your favorite way to fish in real life? Uh, I tell ya, my favorite way... See, it's hard, because I, I also enjoy other ways. Uh, I do enjoy fly fishing. I, I believe I'm not, uh, as, like, uh, patient in, like, uh, attention to details. Um... All that sort of stuff that that fly fishing might require but I do enjoy fly fishing other than that I, I honestly enjoy I know a lot of people haven't tried it or they might think it's cheating or what have you but the feeling of having your your carp rods in, in your carp you know uh, uh, alarms sitting there with uh, a couple of buddies and just chatting about your day and chatting about your week and philosophizing about certain things and then all of a sudden someone's alarm goes off and you're all running to go get this fish and someone's got the net and you're reeling in this 20 pound carp like that's that's a lot of fun um, and if you haven't experienced it then I, I feel bad because it is a blast um, <clears throat> and I think it just might be one of my favorite ways to fish um, cause it just, it really is a lot of fun. That rod is sick. Oh, the special one, the Halloween rod, yeah. <laughs> it sounds like Carl. Llamas! <laughs> Llama day! Currently testing a lot of event lures for St. Patrick's. Ooh. Multiple locations to see what fish they're good for. I'm writing everything on a list, good idea. 878 XP on that guy. Not a whole lot, but we'll take it. It took quite a while to get that bite. So we might have got a unique, but uh, I guess we had two other bites that were pretty good as well. But it's been fairly slow since then. Fairly slow. So let's see. Day five. Good day to fish. Should we try at night? I feel like we're not gonna catch anything. Oh, already that second rod's starting to move again. We might try at night. Are you using the pro tension setup for your rod reel line? Guy L, I have already talked about this multiple times. I'm so tired of talking about it. If I could turn it off altogether, I would. Does that help explain it at all?
trying to figure out where my dreams are. Got so many, so many glasses over here. Hunting close to the Oregon Idaho border. Oh, okay. Well, I gotcha. I got a guy I know that lives in Oregon. Enjoys hunting over there. YouTube Wolf Boys is a hub man. Look at that. No longer a hub boy, but a hub man. I like it. I called you YouTube Wolf Boy, but I guess your YouTube Wolf plays, huh? Just couldn't I couldn't adapt. <clears throat> All right, let's test it. Can we get an Arapaima at night? Because that would be ideal. That would be ideal if we could. We might see some uh, electric eels dancing around over there as well. I know a spot in our life, October, probably spring too, I can catch 16 inch brown trout each time. That sounds awesome, Cooler Cactus. If I could do that, I would. Where is this spot, BZ? I'll show you. I'll show you. Um, you can catch tons of crappie too at that spot. Ooh, dang. Just getting better and better. Really liking the bony shad for attainment. Okay. Um, I love catfish and trout fishing. That's about all we got in Kentucky. Oh, okay. Um, first off, here's the spot. If you're looking. If you go to the very bottom and you see this little pond right here, uh, it's not a pond, but it looks like it. Just this little part on the bottom. Um, and then you go up. It's right as you come in, so um, I can show you the exact, exact uh, blanking on what those are called. But you know what they are, and uh, hopefully it helps you find it. <clears throat> Golly. Okay. <laughs> Catfish and trout, though. Uh, see, and that's a great thing about carp fishing, because when you're out carp fishing... The trout love carp bait, or not trout, um, catfish love carp bait as well. So while you're fishing, like you might catch a, a catfish. In fact, uh, two of the guys on the uh, on the carp uh, group here in Kansas City caught two channel cats. Um, each of them almost weighed 25 pounds. Ridiculous, ginormous channel cat, um, which is pretty fantastic. Is this gonna work? Oh, 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 now we got two of them going. This is just a, a baby. So hopefully we can just reel him in here. He looks like a giant bowfin with he's so small. 67 pounds. I love that small. This freaking small dude right here, 67 pounds. <laughs> Loads of unis at night. I'll, it'll work well for you. Oh, that's good. Because that's what I'm all about. If we can fish at night for a fish, that's 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 what I'm looking for. Uh, Triura, Arapaima, I don't really care. But if we can catch them at night, that's what matters. Because that, that is the true grind there. You can truly grind something if you can uh, fish for them regularly. And, uh, and fishing for them at night doesn't get more regular than that. Gonna lose tension on this guy. Get in here, man. You're done. You're done. It's like a teacher at school when he sees kids fighting. You're done. Get in here. Little seventy, little seventy-one pounder there. Come on, Hino, pick up the rod already. But God, dude, I was hitting. Two. Why would you pick up that one? Ugh. Normally just channel cats. I got gotcha. you. Wasn't on the last stream because I was finishing a project for school. Now that I am almost done, I can watch your stream. TTV. Well, good deal. <clears throat> People call you wolf, though. Of course they do. Of course they do, because you're a wolf. There's trout, carp, catfish, crappie, smallmouth, and largemouth, and musky. There's probably more, too. You're supposed to end it with, oh my. 
Oh my! That's awesome. Though. What like river is your favorite in fishing planet? Oh, people ask me this all the time. Um, I'm not sure if I have a a quote unquote favorite, but I have uh, some that I prefer going to just because they're more fun in my opinion. I I really like uh, blue crab. I like weeping willows for the carp fishing. Uh, I also like Saint Croix. I think Saint Croix has a nice um, group of fish species. You got the big blue cat, they got the musky and pike, um, they even got some decent trout and they got big walleye there too. Um, and a sturgeon, which is difficult to catch sometimes. So yeah, I, I think they're all fun. St. Croix is just a fun place. Um, Kneet Creek is okay. I don't know. It has its moments for me. Sometimes I, I'm like really craving to go after a bunch of salmon and other times I just think it's annoying. So it just depends on what mood I'm in. Last winter I was ice fishing and caught a 42 inch northern pike. Very nice, dude. How much, do, how much does that weigh? 42 inches? Obviously it's, what, three and a half feet? I'm trying to think. So we got two feet, two feet right there. Three feet, three and a half. It's a, it's a, it's a good fish. Good, good sized fish there, man. Very nice. Patty Allen's here again. Good deal. Level 67, where should I go to reach level 68? Great question, Pigson. Uh, I'd say go, uh, go fish. You know, just get out there. Get out there and catch a big one. It's usually, um, usually just kind of the, the overall goal in Fishing Planet is, uh, is to go catch the big fish. If you just kind of follow that general theme in Fishing Planet, um, it'll work out for you most of the time. Go, I need to finish my project for school. Hey, hey, schools, uh, school is important, man. Go get them. You, you go get them. Ah, oh, the bite has slowed down, though. We'll give it one more minute, and then we're moving. Not really moving, but we're changing the time. 102 pounds sturgeon. Very nice, dude. That's awesome. Adding the new ocean map to fish. Remember the video you make. Uh, who knows? What did they say? It was 10% complete? So, I could be the end of next year, you know? We don't know. What levels this count? We're uh, 71 right now. 71 and uh, almost a quarter. We got a ways to go. Kind of feeling, I don't know, the bite's real slow right now. The bite's real slow right now. Should we go to this day? Let's see. Let's go to this. We'll, uh, cast out again. Catch a few more on this night. Once we get to the one day, we'll, uh, do some, do some stuff. Do some stuff, then. Neat Creek is trash now. The developers have nerfed the place. They've nerfed the place? How they nerfed the place? Hunter Call of the Wild. No! I never, I was never patient enough for that stuff. Um, I don't know, when the great one came out and people were talking about, like, killing, like, I don't even know, thousands of whitetail to, like, spawn a great one, I was just like, how is this a hunting game anymore? It's like Call of Duty, but it's animals instead of people. I don't know, it just felt weird to me. So I kind of stopped playing after that point tried to continue making videos over it and kind of like stay hyped about it but it just died in my eyes when's premium have the next discount black friday man it's coming up everyone better mark their calendars if they're interested in getting uh some black friday uh fishing planet premium half price so you can get an entire year fishing planet tell your parents you know, let them in on the uh, on the Christmas. Maybe it can be a Christmas present, an early Christmas present. Let them know how much money they're gonna save. A thirty dollar uh, game, save save thirty bucks. Really, 
not a bad. It's a, it's a really great deal. And uh, it will really help you out. If you enjoy playing Fishing Planet, it will really help you out leveling up and uh, making money in the game to progress. Bro, come on. It was literally sitting there for three seconds. What is one fish you want to be added? Ooh. Uh, it's, a, it's a tough call. It's in between, like, the Goonch catfish in India. Or uh, wherever wherever that is, Indonesia. Um, and then, um, and then like, uh, I feel like a Golden Dorado would be kind of fun as well. Golden Dorado would be a neat fish. Um... But, uh, I mean, there's a lot of ocean fish that would be pretty cool as well. Come on, you're in the teens. 145 pounder there. Good deal. What about you? What's everyone else's? If you could have one fish added to fishing plant, what would it be? What do you think? The best place for XP at level 50. Weeping willows, of course. I don't know, we're gonna have to do some science experiments here. Figure out the best. 142 pound unique gilded, let's go. Not my PB though. Oh, well, still pretty good, man. Definitely plan on picking up a year of premium during the sale, heck yeah. There are a few times that didn't enjoy it too much. Slaying is fun, went for the first time today, but have been farming steelhead lately. Farming steelhead, huh? How you and the wife been? Not too shabby. You know, we, uh, uh, she was real sick for like two days, and since then it's been better, and, uh, she got off quarantine yesterday, I got off today, um, so we've just kind of been doing our own thing. She went back to work today, and then I, I, I obviously work from home, so I didn't really have to do anything, but... They need to add the goonch. I agree, man. It'd be fun fish. You gotta add the annoying stingrays. That's what they need, yeah. Giant freshwater stingrays that stick to the bottom like a suction cup. There we go. There's 6,000 6, XP. Pretty quick, anyway. Where people troll really fast. Would be pretty neat, wouldn't it? Put this in the wrong spot. You're definitely in the wrong spot. My my. Need to add more sharks, eh? More sharks. A couple days ago. Very nice. Amber Jackson, Goliath Grouper. That would be cool. Goliath Grouper, yeah, definitely. Have the um God I'm blinking. Trevally, giant Trevallis. That'd be a fun, fun fight. Oh, got one going, got one going here, little baby. He's a little baby. Come here, little baby. The game is starting to get boring. I, I always tell people that. Get wrecked. How many times have I said this, huh? How many times have I said this? The goal. When you start fishing the sturgeon, and you you have to get to level 50, the goal is to not get bored of fishing planet. It's not necessarily to get to level 50. It's to not get bored, because you're gonna get bored if you just do the same thing over and over again. And uh, so many people, when they get into fishing planet, they just want to know, you know, where do I grind? How do I get from this place to this place? And how do I go from here to here? And it's just like, man, you're going to get burnt out if you do that. Going to get burnt out. Mix it up. Fish at some different places, you know? Remember, it's a fishing game. It's not a grinding game. Now, if you're getting bored, it's most likely because you're not fishing. You're grinding. Oh, no, we got two of them at the same time. I'm 
hesitant to pick up the uh, other rods. It was just little babies, though. Not too bad. Come on, pick it up, you know. Just little babies. Just don't like switching all your rods over to carp specific rods. Okay. Sorry. <laughs> I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> Get over it. Is that what you want to hear? Is that what you want to hear from me? Huh? Is that what you need, Jake Doolittle? You need some tough love? I'll give you some tough love, brother. Get over it. Switch over them rods, bruh. Just do it. You got all the unique ghosts. You know, if you, if you get all the same rod, right? Get all the same carp rod, then you can just make one template, and you can just go click, 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 and then you're ready to go. It seems like a pretty decent size Arapaima. He's not fighting as much as that unique that we caught, but he could be a decent size like trophy or something like that. Or he could just be a regular one. Got a big old head on him though. You can always tell at the Arapaima when they jump out of the water and you see that big head out of the water. Got a perch that was 427 pounds. Nice. 64 because of easy. I've never been bored. Oh, that's good. Grouping. I like to hear it. You should make a playthrough of real VR fishing. You know, we played that for one uh, one video, and people really did like it. I'll be curious to see if uh, people like it uh, this next year of uh, January, you know, gaming month. We might do more of it, because people really did like that game. Um, <clears throat> I'm not sure if I just cracked some sort of uh, YouTube algorithm, or if people really do like that game, because... Uh, yeah, I think of all the videos we put out during that month, that was like the highest performing one out of all of them. I don't know how. Like the one video of playing it got like, I don't know, 26,000 views or something in the month. It was crazy. So, yeah, maybe we'll do more videos of that during uh, January. Surgeon was boring, so I would fish for muskie at Kneek Creek because it was fun. With the gone lower, muskie works well. That's good. Yeah. You know, I was saying that this guy was small in the beginning, but now he's putting up more of a fight. Any unis today? We have, yeah. Yeah, we saw some dancing unicorns today already. And he was new PB at that. Been watching you for the past two weeks from the beginning of my fishing plan career and all of your beginner series videos all helped me progress level 23. It's been a huge help, Finn L says. Well, fantastic, Phil. Uh, Finn, I just co connected those two together. Finn L. Um, but Finn, fantastic. Glad to hear it. That's a great. Managed to reel in a unique red tail cat and a gill cat. Fantastic, Ruben. Am I just here to give pats on the back today? Huh? Huh? Just everyone just coming in and telling me what's going on. I'm just handing them out. Good job. A and and you. Good job. I think that's what everyone needs. Just a little bit of positivity in their life. You know, you show up to the live stream. You know, you say something. I right. oh, what what happens? Share a little positivity. Hey, good job. You know what? What are you doing? What? Are you, how's school going? Doing good. Hey, good job. You're doing good, doing well. They're gonna add that wish mod. They gotta add rods with rod stands because you see most boats with like four or more rod stands, but then with actually in game cash instead of bait coins. Yeah, makes you wonder how they're gonna do that. I've always been told that the reason they don't add rod stand or you know rod holders in the boats is because of the fishermen. And uh, if they do that, then it takes away something from the fishermen. But it makes you wonder if they'll finally like just give up with the fishermen and uh, add in add in rod holders. I tell you what, this guy is teaching us a lesson, is he not? Goodness gracious. We uh, had him in the 30s for like two minutes. And I was saying how he had a pretty decent sized head on him. But now he's way out there doing dolphin flips and stuff. Oh, oh no, we're just stuck. I was gonna say, can we not move? Is 
see what would be a cool fishing planet thing is if I could just jump in the boat right now and chase him down. That would be next level fishing planet. Oh, this guy's putting up a bit of a fight. Better get in the boat. Follow him. You know? That would be cool. What's up, man? Mom says. Sup? 476 pounds. 42 pounds setup. Wow. That's it's hard to believe. I I I, I have a hard time believing that. Just got a level 40, Ghost says, fantastic. Still no Rainbow Outlaw. Well, what's going on? Look at this dude, freaking taking us out again. 140, 150, 160, 170. I'm just holding on for dear life right now. Dude's just going out of town. Only got another freaking 50 some feet of line. If I could do math. So is this a new PB that we've got? Goodness gracious. What's the like goal? Uh, you know, I usually go with a like goal of just 100. You know, if we could hit 100, I think would be good. Nicole. And I've already got a unique today, so it's not like I haven't been performing. So, you know, I think everyone's being a little stingy on their likes. If if you want to know. Am I doing that the right side? If you want to know what I think. I don't know which side I'm supposed to be in. Is it supposed to be this side? I think it is. I think it's supposed to be that side. <laughs> I don't, who, am I, who am I whispering to? All right, we got him at 100 feet. He he finally he lost his steam. He had he was he was fuming for a little bit there. Pretty upset. Took us out to 200 feet. Now we're making headway. Look, like he's not even up on top of the water anymore either. He's way down low. What do we got? Number one on the leaderboard, Arapaima here. On the match catch, the match catch. I I can indeed, Chan. 292 pounds with the with the popper. Wow, very nice. With the popper. Today and tomorrow you graduate. Wow, geez, Louise. How deep are we fishing? Not too deep. Not too deep. Like 22 inches. What lure should you use for that? I mean, the swim baits. People have been talking about the swim baits doing okay. Off-road outlaw. Hey, hey, Tideline Jason B says, what do we got here? What do we got here? Big head on him. Oh, baby! Goodness gracious, he's smaller than the last one we caught, but that was our second Arapaima uh, unicorn of the night. So that is that is all right. He's got a, a big old uh, jack-o'-lantern. Uh, can't, can't turn it off either. <laughs> Big old jack-o'-lantern uh, light on his face there. Uh, that will just have to work, everybody. Take a look at him. Yep, yep. Big fish. Second air plima unicorn of the evening. Uh, he knows, of course, doing his alien rock bending work there like an avatar. Very sweet, very sweet. Oh, did we do the unicorn already? We did. Okay, good deal. I didn't I didn't look up and see. Goodness gracious. Oh 366. So 328. Very nice. Well, smaller than the last one, like I said. That's another 23,000 XP though. I'll take it. Look at this dude. Just chillaxing right here. What you doing there, bud? Just, uh, just doing a little, oh, oh, he's gone. Oh, he's back. What you doing? What are you doing there, YouTube wolf boy? Just, uh, look like you're about to pop something out at him.
Uh, okay. Let's, uh, I don't think we're gonna catch anything for the night. Let's just move on to the next night. Let's go. Sub to you about a year ago. Forgot about this channel until now, and honestly, I miss watching your vids daily. Sped! Well, we're glad you made it back, man. I always think about that a lot of times. Um, I'm like, um... Always think Soprano. Captain, you got one more level. One more level. Um, I always think, you know, do people, uh, do people leave and never see us again, you know? Got 33,000 XP rather quickly, I feel. Mostly because we got that uni, I guess, so. If we wouldn't have caught that guy, probably wouldn't have been as much. Playing this game on Android. Well, very cool. Mm. The biggest, but still a big one. Very true. Very true. So how strong is your character is carrying the fish like I Italian? I tell I say this all the time, man. That's why he's an alien. Inhuman strength. You're the only person to like the stream. I, you and 51 others, anyway. I appreciate everyone who's liked the stream. I appreciate it. Really do. You're glitched on the screen. I would have to agree with you. You're, uh, you definitely seem like a broken animatronic at a, uh, theme park or something like that. You look like you're supposed to pop up and go, In 1775, I caught an Arapaima for the first time. Wearing this headlamp and using no rods whatsoever. I just caught him. He was just sitting there in the water, and I reached my hand out and grabbed him. But you're you're broken, you're just stuck right there. Alrighty, another one going off here. So far, the night fishing for Arapaima has been alright. We haven't been catching a lot of big ones. We're using 10 knot hooks though, so I'm sure that keeps a lot of the smaller ones. Uh, it, it keeps us from catching any mid-sized ones, I should say. Catching a lot of uh, either side of the aisle. Small ones and big ones. With uh, giant hooks. Try to catch the wolf fish. Catch the wolf fish. Maybe we will. Maybe we will. Should we do that? Should we just go do that? The only thing, I th only thing I'm thinking is, uh, can we catch them at, at night? Let's see. You get the blue gray rod. Blue gray rod with the runes on it is a Halloween DLC rod. We just got it to do the Halloween stuff, but it's prettier than the other rod, so I just figured I'd keep using it. It's the same stats, pretty much. It's the same stats. How's the stream been? Not too bad. We got two uh, Uni Arapaima so far. Can't can't complain. Can you sow more Way of the Hunter? Can you sow more Way of the Hunter? You're like... Sounded very... Uh, I don't even know how to say it. Sow more Way. Sow more Way. Can you use a mono leader with Fluoro Line? Trying to have my leader li higher than line rod and reel what you you can um i'm not I'm not sure what you're going for there bling ting same time you cut there upon i caught it when you mirror carp 87 pounds very nice 
All right, all right, all right. Let's do some titanium leaders. Let's see here. We got, what we got in here? 79. Let's just do this. I don't know if they would bite through it or not. I feel like we'd be fine if we didn't. But let's do it just for the heck of it. Should we do large minnows? I don't even know. I'm going to leave one with a fluorocarbon just because I'm curious. And then we'll do we'll do titanium on the rest of them. 70.5 on that one. Uh, we also have this bad boy, which we could throw. Buzz bait of some sort. I could throw a titanium leader on that as well. Okie dokie. Should be good to go. And see huge fish jumping out of the water from the dogs or no because instead of the fish looking small jumping out of the water it shows a huge fish yeah the arapaima that show up are, are humongous that's what i earn a day at emerald like yeah boats are expensive yeah they're a little expensive all right are we still in a good fishing time let's try it i'm just gonna throw one bottom rod and one match rod just to make it easy Oh, too big a hook on this one. Whoops, a daisies. I think I remember using seven knots for the Triera. Could be wrong. Ghost with the dollar. Thanks, Ghost. Appreciate it, man. See if we can get a trier at night. Otherwise, we can switch to the day. Keep fishing. You love catching catfish in real life? I do too. I think it's pretty darn fun, don't you? I don't think we're gonna catch one at night, but we'll uh, we'll do it anyway, just to just so we don't sit here doing nothing. Try your uh, go get it. Do more way of the hunter. I, I plan to. That that's definitely on my on my plans, man. I'd love to play that game more. It seemed pretty fun. If anything, to just fill out the uh, fill out the lodge sounded like fun. My goodness. Well, thank you again. Hello from Malaysia again. Hello, hello. How are ya? How's Malaysia doing? Can you sh catch a shark, please? You know, we were just over- oh, look at this guy. We just came over here to uh, catch Traeer, because someone else had just mentioned Traeer, and now people are asking about sharks, so. We're gonna catch some Traeer up for a little bit, then we'll see. Then we'll see, eh? Top notch, little trophy triera. I mean, obviously that's six thousand XP. These triera, they're crazy, aren't they? You know what are you doing? Come on now. I told you not to embarrass me during the streams. Everyone's watching. Well, there goes a rod. Is it a titanium or a fluorocarbon one though? That's the question. 
Is it gonna snap off? We'll find out, won't we? There's another try here, though. Will you ever do a competition again? Ah, uh, maybe. I don't know. I'm not a big fan of, like, planning out my day in that way. I already have one planned live stream every Monday and Wednesday. It's hard to do more than that in my mind. Golly. Just caught the pike slasher. Very nice. Well, a dollar at a moment. Just a dollar, dollar, dollar. Can we see the dogs? Um, depends on where they are. But yeah, it could be something fun. You use seven or eight odds. Ooh. Doing good. That's good. What leader do you use on a match rod? Uh, just depends on what I'm fishing for. Usually I try to do... Um, of course, I just try to max out the uh, drag at this point. But I usually try to stick to fluorocarbon or... Uh, or um, titanium based off of what I'm fishing for. But how much longer are we fishing for? Uh, another 45 minutes, basically. Until 9.30 p.m. Central Time. So another 45 minutes so or so. Omega Mbanga. Whoa. Very cool. Tips on catching the Pike Slasher? Uh, God, what did we do in the uh, video? We fished for him one way, and then we totally changed it up. We like uh, we went back to the dock and just fished off the dock with a rod stand or something like that, and used uh, bottom rods or feeder rods or something like that. I think that's how we caught him. It like made it seem like you needed to use match rods and use bobbers or whatever, and I tried that for the longest time and never caught him. So. Hooks. I'm not USA. Uh, OTS. What does OTS mean? Or is that an acronym for something? The the OT only means like it's just it's a larger hook size basically. I if you watch my beginner video, it kind of breaks down the hook sizes for you. It's gonna be a little piranha. Little piranha. Brown and rainbow trot instead of the outlaw. Oh no. Look at this from the Pollock. Very cool. Hey, thank you so much, dude. It's a fly with your catfish. Even better. Fantastic. Oh, what do you know? What do you know? And ghost again. Get two more in. Golly. Golly, guys. He add you on fishing planet. I, I don't know. What level are you? You're on PlayStation? I'm not on PlayStation, unfortunately. So, can't do it. Ugh. Alright, let's see. Not on PlayStation, unfortunately. Let's see, if we do this, then we might be able to move time forward a little bit. We got 12,000 XP for those uh, few that we caught, those two try here we caught. Or was it three? I can't remember now. Nine aught hook, what does the aught stand for? Um, it's just, I'm not really sure, um, to be honest. If you look up a Wikipedia article on it, I'm sure it'll tell you. All I know is that uh, if you imagine starting at zero, I, I, I break this down, like I said, in the beginner guide video. But if you imagine starting at zero, if you start counting one, two, three, four, as you go up in numbers, the hook gets smaller. It actually gets smaller as you go to, you know, a size 20 hook is very, very small. However, um, from the other side of zero, when you go to one aught, two aught, three aught, four aught, the hook's getting larger. So on one side, you know, number one, number two, number three, as the number gets larger, the hook's getting smaller. But as you have the zero on the end, the one aught, two aught, three aught, the number is meaning a larger hook. So I'm not really sure. Yeah, it was. It's not spelled O T. Um, don't believe anyway. But yeah, it's 
I'm not exactly sure what it stands for. I part of me is thinking like uh, the wire gauge or something they used for the hook, but at the same time, I, I really don't know. Uh, well, don't spin anymore. Goodness gracious. Bait casting or spinning? Um, I, you know, I, I do a lot more spinning in my time. I have a bait cast. I have a few bait casting rods, but I, I just think spinning is easier. Which is weird, because, you know, when you're starting and you're using, like, a spin cast reel, and you're used to pressing the button and just throwing it out there, you just think it's going to be way easier. But I, I tend to use spinning rods a lot more. It's because I feel like they're less to deal with. Don't have to adjust everything for every single lure you try, and <clears throat> I don't know. I, to me, it's a lot of work, but it's honestly not. I just think it's too much to deal with most of the time. Well, this day's just kind of poopy, isn't it? We haven't got a single thing yet. Oh, nipples, nipples, nipples. Oh, there's a little rod bend. I was going to say, what do we got here? It's not really doing much at the moment. So, it's a piranha. Oh, baby. Well, there's a unicorn piranha. Goodness gracious. And we and we got some from Ghost again. Goodness gracious. <laughs> Well, thank you, Ghost, but I don't want you to get in trouble. If you're, if you, if you're gonna get in trouble, don't, don't do anymore. I appreciate it all the same. Okay, there goes another rod. This one's a little bit more spunky, eh? It's just the it's just the name they came up with ACW. Hunt Showdown. I have not. No. It looked like an interesting game though. When's the C update going to come out? I don't know. It's, uh, December of next year. Uh, uh, why? How would I know? I just play this game. I'm just like all of you. Guys, putting up a bit of a fight. Goodness gracious, we got another fish on. This dude's putting up a bit of a fight. I don't think he's an uni, but he's putting up a fight. I really don't want him to go out into that open water over there. Come on, dude. There we go. Trophy! 6,600 bucks. Can we grab this real quick? No! Dude, we just picked it up. I hate that. That is the, literally the worst. When you're literally picking up the rod and fishing plan, it's like, Oops! It's gone! Mm, sorry! It's like, dude... You could have, like, I, if I would have lost it at any point leading up to me picking it up, I would have been like, ah, dang, we missed it. But the fact that I'm, like, literally picking up the rod, and then you're telling me I missed it, like, I just have to call like, BS on that. An uni is an uni, no matter how small. It sounds like the start of a Dr. Seuss quote. <laughs> Casting rods, but I love the River Tech Zeus and Jig Water spinning rods. Ooh, okay. Hey, thousand pike fishing. Don't doubt it. Those bikes are pretty great, aren't they? In the house. Can't wait for the sturgeon. Ghost, goodness gracious. Thank you again, goodness, goodness.
10 size, 8 size, etc. to keep them easily, they call big ones ought. They ought to call them something else, like a large one, a large two, a large three. Oh, what you looking for? A large four hook? Oh, I got a package of large four hooks over here. Then they could have gone with small one, small two, small three. Now they go with oughts, as if that means anything. Stupid. Huh? Am I right? And what's funny is there's a lot of like outdoorsy people out there who consider themselves outdoorsy people. But if you bring up the whole sizing of hooks thing, they are bewildered by it. They don't know. They just don't. And it just, it, it's crazy, because it's just like, it's way harder than it needs to be. All they had to do was call one size of the hooks small, and the other one's big, and it would have been no big. Large, large hooks and small hooks is all they would have had to do. And there would have been no confusion whatsoever. I had one try here to come up and try to grab it. I've been using two speed and they they caught the one that one time but that one just missed it I'll, I'll uh I'll switch to a one speed here we only have one match rod out too I just noticed Goodness gracious, Pollock. I'm care I mean, I have to look up the conversion. What is that? What is that in American dollars? I'm curious. Low hanging out. Thank you so much. Appreciate it. Can we do more bass fishing? Oh god. Pro probably not. This whole stream is about grinding. We're trying to grind things so that we can level up, right? We aren't gonna do that from bass fishing. We're uh, trying to figure out what would be the best. Obviously, today is not a very good day for Triura because we're not catching too many of them. Not fishing at the best time either. Could be fishing closer to uh, the end of the evening where it gets a little bit better, but I was hoping we might be able to catch a few, change the time a little bit, and catch more, but... Yeah, that's how I usually just... Uh how I usually explain it. Can we try uh, a swim bait? Yeah, I got some swim baits in here. The one tried to go after that top water. He missed it. Fishing for flatheads, very nice. Very nice. premium worth buying it's the only thing I recommend people buying so yes I think so spinning your bait cast I, I I like I said that I tend to spin more than bait cast I think they're easier to use hmm interesting the big piranha again oh it's a ripsaw catfish okay interesting well, this has been a stinker of a day hasn't it been ever fished in california no and i even lived there for a few months and i never fished uh, which is frustrating but uh should have i i was pretty close to the coast as well i could have done some ocean fishing but it just was never... I honestly don't even think I brought any rods and reels with me. Um, I was living with my wife, who was my girlfriend at the time, or my fiance, and I just brought my bare essentials. I brought my computer and clothes and... Um, pretty sure that was it. Um, yeah. Let's see changing the time again. Should we try to fish in, in the late evening or go back to night? I don't think we'll go back. Go back to night here. Yeah, I, I was concerned. Good deal, Lauren. Glad you made it. 
All is well in the world now. It is indeed. Blake Fane, thanks for the sub. Do you like Bassmaster 2022? Uh, not necessarily. I mean, it was okay for a little bit. Fun little change of pace. Uh, it's not, I don't think I'd recommend it to someone. The come that the wolfish gave me a lot of levels. What? But yeah, they do. They, uh, they give you quite a bit of experience and, and monies. Fishing Falcon Lake and Everglades at the minute. Very cool, Daft World. Glad it's working out for you. Always, uh, always happy to hear that it's helping people move forward. I know, Ghost is on fire today. Goodness gracious. I just don't want you to get in trouble. You, you met, and Ever since you mentioned that you might get in trouble, I've, I've been worried for you. Is this another rip song? Frippin'. Frippin'. Wow, look at that guy. Goodness gracious. Didn't expect that. But I'll take it. We'll, we'll mark him. Unique ripsaw in the same spot we've caught so many other fish. Right here? Oh, I think we got a try here on. Boy, we've had quite a few boogies this uh, this live stream. Goodness gracious. I am 11. Well, that's good. Look at this freaking dude. Trophy try here. Another 5,600 XP. I'll take it. What day is best for Arapaima? Well, see, uh, I wrote... I caught the last unique Arapaima during, uh, this day. Um, this day. In the evening. We caught our last unique Arapaima, but... Uh, I caught the one in the River Monsters episode on this day five here. For the Oon. Oh, well, thank you. Appreciate it, guys. Goodness gracious. Uh, but we caught our other, uh, one during the River Monsters episode on day five. So, I'm not really sure. Well, when we get to day five, we'll we'll go back to the Arapaima spot and try it again. See see how it goes. But goodness gracious! Well, thank you, Ghost. Golly, you're just tossing them out at me like I'm a like I'm a, a, a video gaming something or other <laughs> something you throw dollar bills at. Just join the stream and unicorns start dancing. It's, it's a great sign, isn't it? It's a great sign of a great stream, I hope, anyway. We are 29 likes away from 100. Can we make it? I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Should do a subscriber tournament if it was easy to do and it didn't require a lot of brain power from me. I would totally do it. Captain Unicorn seems to be enjoying his day. I think so. Baseball is better. Hey, Bo. How's it going? Just got a 65-pound mirror. Very nice. The donation. Come by the donation. What? 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 Okay. Let's see if they go for the swim bait again. Oh, and now they got, now they got one on here. That's some rod bend, I'll take that. I like it. Sorry to read something for work real quick. Okay, we're back. How to remove UI. Tilda. You hit the tilde a few times and it goes away. And you can be totally immersed in your fishing 
opportunity, even though I still have my camera and stuff, so it doesn't feel like it to you guys, but... Sounds like Buren knocking on the door. I don't believe so. There was like a helicopter flying by just a little bit ago. I have my window open because I wanted some, some cool air in here. Everyone walking by is probably wondering what the heck's going on, talking about unicorns and stuff like that. 86 pound demon cat, very cool. Cray, hello. Oh, we got another, another one beeping away here. Yikes. Hopefully this guy's gonna be worth it. Hello from Malaysia again. Very nice. Well, we've got quite a few people from Malaysia. 12 hour about to cook up some dinner queue. I'd say so. Goodness gracious. 12 hours, man. You're working hard. Goodness. What is your personal best bass new to your channel? Colt Smith. Um, I'm not really sure. 12 pounds something. I hope it's a unique Remy Gilmore. Has to be a unicorn. Has to be. You think so? He made it out to this deeper water anyway. Any XP level 23 and it's starting to get hard for me to level up now. I have 60k though. Well, that's good, Blake. Have you been watching our free to play beginner series? Might help you out and give you some ideas. Make a lot of money before level 8 just started. Nif and K. Hey, check out the free to play beginner series. Where's the third one? Where's the third one? Someone else better ask me that question so I can say, check out the free to play. This is a trophy. No, it's a unique! Wowie Zowie! Oh boy! Oh! <coughs> Goodness gracious. Oh. <laughs> God, I'm coughing. Well, good deal. It's been a while since I've caught a unique tri euro, so that's great. Alright, we'll keep that guy. 21,000 bucks. 13,000. I'm, I'm, I'm a little upset about the XP. I expected to get more XP. It's a lot of money, don't get me wrong. $21,000 uh, is, is great, but I don't need any money. I need XP. <coughs> so would I rather catch one unique Triera today, or would I rather catch a unique Arapaima that gives me 24,000 XP? Probably the Arapaima. So let's let's go back to the Arapaima spot. We finally caught a unique Triera. We got 13,000 XP. Great for money, uh, don't get me wrong, but... Mm, the XP just was not what I was hoping for. What is my PB bass in real life? Well, you have to understand, I don't really fish for bass. <coughs> Golly. Um, I don't really fish for bass, but my PB is like two and a half pounds or something like that. It's not really that big. Boy, you're still doing this, huh? You keep it up. You'll sneak up to that guy at some point. I have, I have faith. I have faith. Alrighty. For the oon. Well, thank you. Goodness gracious. Not even there? Yeah, you can't fool me. You're clearly here. See if we can catch an air pie before we move on to the next night. Boy, we certainly did, didn't we? Little guy, but I'll take him. What's for dinner, bro? We got some deer chili with cornbread. Golly, man, that sounds pretty good. We had uh, ramen. Some real cheap ramen. I got like a 12 pack for like three bucks. <clears throat> Chopped some spring onions in there. 
Um, got a chuck steak for like four fifty or something like that. Um, brewing two packets of ramen, like what, 25, 40 cents a piece or something like that. I think the whole meal for my wife and I cost like five fifty or something, but it was it was good. Well, the spring onions cost some money. A whole bundle of them is like three bucks or something like that, so. Uh, I didn't use the whole bundle. There we go, a little Arapai mom. Little baby. Funniest glitch ever. It is pretty great though. I'm gonna take a little, I'm gonna snap a little pic right here. You and your Arapai you're trying to catch. There you go. We'll, uh, we'll cement you at all time. You're in the history of the BZ Hub now. You and your pet Arapaima you keep trying to catch. Look at that guy out there. What the heck was that? It was small, like a snake or something. Could have been an eel, I guess. There's Narapaima. Dylan Bartron! Is it Bartron? How do I pronounce that? Bartron? Tell you what to donate. You you have donated far far enough, man. Far enough. That's a word. That's a that's a phrase. You've done you've done plenty, Ghost. You're you're doing great. Thank you. I appreciate everything you've done. You don't need to donate anymore, though. Feel 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 weird juggling these rods. Get in here, man. Little 55 pounder. Grab the rod, he knew. This dude's almost out to 100 feet now. Just a regular size Arapaima. We have not caught a trophy today. We have caught unis and we've caught babies. And regulars. Crab legs and chili sauce is, is God. Golly. Just one more? Well, thank you. Goodness gracious. Come on, grab a Hino. Grab a Hino. God, you are driving me insane, Hino. Well, thank you, Ghost. Golly, dude. I'm, I really appreciate it. You're spoiling me tonight. Four unicorns. I feel like we've had more than... Uh, maybe not. Maybe we just had two Arapaima. One one piranha and one... No, we had the Ripsaw. So that would have been five. One Ripsaw and one... Uh, and one Triura. Top notch. Well, we've got some Arapaima anyway. You can catch one more. One more. You want crabs? I need to, um... Is it the snow crab? Blue crab. Snow crab? I think it's snow crab. That's, uh, in Florida. That's my, that's my, uh, thing I, I want to get next time I'm in Florida. I have heard about the legendary crab there. Never had it. Love your vids from Thailand. Ooh, well, thank you so much, dude. Thailand. Very cool. Have you tried Korean noodles? Probably. Can't think of it off the top of my head. Though I will tell you that I currently, um, I don't have much taste and smell due to, due to COVID, so, so everything kind of tastes like bleh to me. So I, I, I usually love food, but I can't taste any of it right now, which is really a, a, a bummer. Because if, if you were ever to see me in real life, you would realize that, you know, I, I obviously love food. So. Five, you're set okay for five. What are you talking about? Goodness gracious. High S tier. <laughs> well, thank you again, Ghost. I'm waiting for the animation to play. There it goes. Yep. Goodness gracious. Well, thank you. 
All right. Yeah, we're streaming for another uh, 14 minutes. Another 14 minutes. Okay. So the the nighttime fishing has been great, but we're gonna try to fish during the day now. Mix it up. Yeah, I realize it started a little bit later, but as my work is doing a lot of stuff and they needed me to do something real late at night. Can you believe that? What what rods do we use for St. Croix? I've had a few videos fishing at St. Croix. I don't know off the top of my head, but uh, I bet you could look them up, figure it out. I wrote this rod down for the next time I go to St. Croix as an upgrade. The Artix 13 foot 2 at level 29. The 26.6 pound braid at level 34. Hornet Swarm 6034. Uh, titanium Leader at 34. For a total of 29,150 is uh, is what I wrote down for uh, a rod to use at St. Croix. So it depends on what level you are, but that's that's what I wrote down for a match rod or pike. Favorite YouTube? Oh, thank you, Ghost Golly. You're uh, you're buttering me up today like lobster. We've been talking about lobster and crab this whole time. So we weren't hit hard by COVID. Well, that's good, Nate. Glad to hear it. Tried biting into a whole stick of butter. If I did, um, it would taste a little bit salty, depending upon if there were salt in it, I guess. And then it would kind of just taste like like Play-Doh or, or uh, you know, something with the consistency of butter. Pretty much just tastes like nothing. I, uh, I'll tell you this. For lunch today, I opened up a can of tuna and ate it raw. Because I could not taste anything, so I just thought might as well eat something healthy, and so I just ate a can of tuna. Um, <laughs> it all tastes the same. I had steak from Chipotle. It, I couldn't taste it. It was just, it was just something that had the consistency of meat and a little bit of salt. Young Arapaima, fantastic. We got him. Ladies and gentlemen, we got him. Throw that back out there. So can last Oh, okay. Lowering in the house. Ghost is just shooting ducks today. Behind is over somewhere else catching sharks, but on your scram, I'm there when I'm not. Oh, you're probably still here. Yep, you're still here, man. Catching that Arapaima. Meet you when you came to Marion, Kansas over the summer. Yeah, Coltsmith. Very true. That was fun. <laughs> yeah, that was a great. Because that was the first time anyone ever uh, recognized He goes, he goes, I, I could hear your voice. Your voice sounded like, like, uh, Bo from PC Up. And I was like, that's hilarious. So, yeah, that was fun. Fun experience. And my, uh, my father-in-law still goes into that store all the time and goes, oh, yeah. Yep, he was, he was working the other day. So, pretty funny. Definitely good. I'm catching a unique Arapaima real good. Well, that's good, Crits Gaming. <clears throat> it's been good for me, too. My goodness, we've caught quite a few. Valde. Valde. Not exactly sure how to pronounce that. Hmm. <sighs> Hopefully, I didn't do too bad. Wonder what licking salt rock is like. Ooh, that would be. Honestly. I would be curious if I just like uh, ate a handful of salt, like how salty it would be. I'm sure, my body wouldn't like it. Oh, you did! That's uh, awesome, Colt. Yeah, I made sure because I, uh, I before that I had a bunch of stickers that uh, I had given to other people, and they'd put them on their like fishing buckets and stuff like that. 
and they'd all like fallen apart over time due to the weather and getting wet and stuff like that. So uh, before I gave him the stickers, I wanted to make sure I got my my weatherproof stickers in. So so you can put those on. Uh, supposedly, you can put them on your fishing bucket or your tackle box or something like that, and they'll be they'll be fine. They won't. They won't break away or disintegrate or anything like that. But that's great. But his on his guitar. Oh, that's awesome. That's hilarious. Oh, we're just catching a bunch of piranha right now. Ugh. Is this your first go around with COVID? Boat? No, it's not. The first time I got it, I got real sick for like one day, and I was fine afterwards. Nothing. No nose stuff, bro. Nothing. This time, uh, I haven't been like super sick on any day, but I've consistently had a stuffy nose and, and my throat's just kind of been bleh. This is the little guy. Do you like or play Last of Us? Can you do it? No, I haven't. I don't have a PlayStation, so I've never played the Last of Us games, but it would be cool. Vegan barbecue is mid. I, I've never had vegan barbecue, I don't believe. I've had a lot of uh, vegan stuff, though. It's one of my weird things that I like to try when I go places. And they say they have a vegetarian something or something. Um, yeah, I, I like to try a lot of weird stuff like that just because I'm like, yeah, maybe it's good. I don't know. So sometimes I'll, uh, I'll get the vegetarian stuff just to see. The other day, I had a... What was it? It was a vegetarian pizza or something like that. Which a lot of pizzas are vegetarian, to be honest. Um, but it was really good. Can't quite remember exactly what I had on it. But if it's vegetarian, you can still eat cheese. I believe. So, cheese pizza is vegetarian. Pretty sure. Right? Only vegans know dairy and stuff like that. I know, he got off there. Creeks of Colorado almost missed it. Well, glad you didn't. I have not got a great one, JB. I'm, I just didn't have the patience for it. So, why is there is an air pilot just sitting there? Ah, that's YouTube Wolf Boy's friend. There he is. Just chillaxing with him. It's just, he's his buddy. A lock. <laughs> sub, sub to, uh, thank goodness. One fighter shark you can catch another, or is it only one? Um, I, I believe it's only one. You can sometimes catch um, multiples of fish if you uh, don't complete a mission, or if you um, if you have one fighting, if you're fighting one on one rod and you get another bite uh, while you're fighting it. It can sometimes be the monster fish again. We did that with the uh, the um, the piranha, the mega piranha, during the Halloween videos. But yeah, boy, the bite has just shut off altogether, hasn't it? Dino nuggies with cheese inside. I've never seen them with cheese inside. That's interesting. Oh, I got time to wait. Lowering in the house. Ghost, you're going crazy. It's going, we got just machine guns going off. It's like Vietnam over here. You have them in the Philippines. Interesting. Got me beat. Had just had to check in on. It. Well, thank you. Yeah, I appreciate it. We got four more minutes, man, and I'm and I'm probably gonna go take a take a nap or snooze or something. I'm too. I'm, though I do want to check in on Fallout 76. I am uh, slightly addicted to that game. 
Oh yeah. Good one. Good one. Yeah, I had some good ones there now. A uh, small fish here, it looks like. Get him in first. Come on, dude. Muscled him in. Good deal. Oh, no. Oh, no. We can see how big this fish is. Then we can determine if we want to fight him or if we want to try to get the other one in. Stick your head up. I don't think he's that big. Let's find out about this guy. This guy isn't too big either. In fact, we just got him in right now. Good deal. Another young Arapaima. Well, that worked out, didn't it? Got all three of them. What's up with the Arapaima? What's up with the Arapaima? Afraid of the monkey, but I don't know. Uh, I feel like I've heard of it a few times, but I, I haven't really heard too much about it. Okay, Colt, I will. After the stream. Two more minutes. I'll check it. Thank you again, Ghost. Goodness gracious. 22 now. Level 24 and I have about $20,000. What place should I be fishing at? Hemingway. Um, it'll, it'll save you some time. If you check out the free-to-play beginner series, Series 2, it will keep you up to date on where you should go at what levels. Um, up to a certain bit since I haven't continued it in a while. But hopefully we'll get back to it. Ghost does it again. Which is better, Cooper says. Everglades. Watch Ghost do one last and then stream. For Fortnite move, do it again. Fortnite move, do it again. Got me. I'm not. I'm too boomer, I guess. I don't understand that. You made it. Are you late? Oh, you're not late. You made it by one minute. Everglades or Emerald Lake? I think Everglades is fun, but it depends on how big your keep net is. You can keep a lot more bass um, a day at Everglades, um, but it all depends on... If you're just fishing nights for e emerald, um, what'll kill you is if you s if you don't have any bait coins and you try just fishing during the day, um, you might get caught in in having to wait five minutes or something like that to change the time to fish for more walleye. Five dollars. You were supposed to stay at one and two dollars. <laughs> Golly, you better not get in trouble, BT Dubs. I'm still worried. I know you said not to worry, but I, I'm still worried about that. <laughs> what is one fish you want to catch in real life? Oh, Goliath tigerfish, of course. It's the ultimate. It's the ultimate angler fish. You catch a Goliath tiger fish, you've made it in the world, in the world of angling. Haven't watched the stream in a while, Deer Hunting TV says. Well, I'm glad you made it. What's with this right now? It's freaking ridiculous. Catching piranhas. What the heck? It's the biggest donation of the stream, yeah, because I don't know how to convert Polish dollars, Polish monies, but I assume it's got to be close to, if anything. 
pause for, for video or stream it has to do with San Joaquin I you certainly could we also have a uh, place in the discord where you can uh, recommend video ideas and stuff like that so check that out if you haven't seen it anyway everyone uh, I tell you at one point we maxed out like a hundred and some uh, hundred and some people watching but we never hit a hundred likes you know what that's okay you just disappointed me a little bit and don't try to make up for it now you missed your chance you missed your chance to make me feel good uh, and, and that's okay ghost has been has been donating and that's been that's been fun anyway Rohan here how's it going both in don't give much when are your stream days Monday and Wednesday 7 30 to 9 30 p.m. Central First stream in a while. Glad to be back. Right on, massive gross on the subs. Nice. Best of luck. How goes it? It's going quite well. I caught a bunch of piranhas at the end here. That was great. <laughs> oh god. Okay. Top notch. Everglades of Saint Croix. Saint Croix, obviously. E S S, man. Come on. Get the chonkla. What? The chonkla. Anyway. See you all next time on Wednesday for our next live stream, obviously, at 7.30, so we'll see you then. This has been fun. I've been uh, imp uh, enjoying this, I guess. It's been great. Have a great night. You as well. Biggest fish you've caught uh, in real life or the game? Um, it's the fire shark in the game. It's the uh, tiger, the um, alligator gar in real life. Anywho, that'll do it, I believe. Anywho, yeah, anywho, anywho, anywho. We'll see you all next time. Take care, and as always, remember everyone, we're one planet, one family, game on.